For this example, we're going to place the tabs in the bypass tray. Once you place the tabs in the bypass tray, it will prompt you on the screen for the type of paper you're using. Choose Tab Paper. Choose OK. Now, let's go back to your computer. Begin by opening the file you wish to have tabs inserted into. Choose File, and then Print. Use the drop-down to select your BizHub. Choose Properties. Now choose Cover Mode. Choose Per Page Setting. And now Edit List. We can begin by editing the list name. Choose OK. Now specify Add. Indicate the page number of which the tab is to appear after. For print type, we're going to change the setting to reflect Insert Blank Sheet. Now highlight Tab Paper. Change that setting to reflect Use. Under Text on Tab, we will begin typing the text. Notice up here we have a visual of what the tab will look like. Now we can choose Add. Now again, we're going to specify the page number of which the tab is to appear after. Print Type. Once again, we will change that to Insert Blank Sheet tab paper, we will specify use, and again we'll type in the text. Choose add. Indicate the page number. Change the print type to insert blank sheet. Change tab paper to use, and then type in the text. Choose add again. Change the settings, and again the text. N make note, on the text we can actually have three lines of text. Notice our visual. And for our last tab. Again, we're going to change the settings. and type in the final amount of text. And choose OK. Choose OK again, and to print the job, choose OK one last time. Now, if we go back to the BizHub, you'll notice not only are we printing the job, but we're also inserting tabs. For more information and other items you can do on your BizHub, contact your BizHub rep. Thank you.